Hi and welcome to Easy Fishing. Now as this title of video will tell you this is about my own personal nightmare. So this is how it goes. Uh, about three weeks ago I set off to uh, shoot a video on the canal using the pole for big carp. I managed to uh, catch a bream of about four pounds which is good for the canal and a beautifully unmocked uh, common carp of about 19 pounds. However, while I was playing the fish, a father and about four kids appeared getting really excited and after I'd successfully netted the fish, and returned it as I wanted to get it back in the water as quickly as possible, I reviewed the film. Only to find out that somebody had turned the video camera off. To say I was uh, upset would be an understatement. So I shrugged it off. About a week later, I set off back down the canal again. Similar area, same purpose, big cop on the pole. And while I didn't manage uh, a big carp, I did manage mm, four or five good brain to four, four and a half pounds. However, while I was in the process of catching them, a group of guys appeared behind me and the language was terrible and I'm not prepared to put a YouTube video up with bad language on it. So that one got deleted. Then uh, on Monday night, I went out again. Went to a different section of the Grand Union, a long walk away from other people. I thought I'll get away from them. Set it all up. And as I always do, I did a sound test on the video. I normally say like easy fishing, one, two, three, testing. Stop the video, play it back to make sure the sound quality is good. This time it was. So I sat down, started fishing, and I got a big carp. Uh, while I was playing it, the bailey from my angling club came along, said hello, and netted the fish for me. Got it out on the unhooking mat, beautiful fat mirror carp you can judge for yourself and uh, I asked him just to take a couple of stills while I was with the fish on the unhooking mat which he duly did so I went home very happy with James Brown's song I feel good in my head and imagine the way I felt when I put it up and I found that the sound had gone. It was very crackly, noisy, and no volume. I tell you, I could have cried. So anyway, I'm just going to uh, put a short clip on here of that video and a couple of stills of the fish, so you can see <coughs> what I caught. Now, anybody who thinks making fishing videos is easy on your own, think again. It is not. It is very, very stressful. And I mean, I'm a pretty competent angler, and on three occasions I've been out to make a video. Twice I've succeeded with big carp, and all three times the video has turned out to be rubbish. So, Anybody who thinks they're going to have a go at this, please bear in mind, it's not as easy as it looks, as I have found out. So, I'm going to try and get back on the bank, uh, 
possibly tomorrow I shall see. Um, but until then, tight lines.